out like crazy today. Huge shout out to Frank giving me their extra parking pass so I will be bringing the truck into the show today which is absolutely insane. Now I'm not parking in the show but there's an exhibitor parking section that I have a pass for which is really cool so not only am I going to the Rick Rick Raw show today but my truck is going as well. That's freaking cool. Look, color shift wrap. Are we gonna have to wait in the line or no? Y'all notice the line's going really long back that way and there ain't no line over here. Are we gonna make it in or what? Guess we're about to find out. Nah, we didn't get that lucky, I guess. I guess we're going through the grass. My four wheel drive don't work though. Oh, this is terrifying. This is proving to be some form of a mission to get into the show. I was told that we're trying to go through the back gate. So this is the main gate that we went in last year. That is the main gate this year down that way where the line is going. I was told we're going through the back gate not either one of these, so I don't know what the plan is. Oh no, what are we doing? Oh, we're going through the back. Oh! They're coming to save us. What's the deal? I don't know what's going on. They made it in. They aren't playing any games about trying to get into this show this year. This is almost why I didn't want to bring my truck, but I got my truck now, so I'm kind of stuck, you know? This sucks. You see how they're parking 18 wheelers down the whole front of the lawn so nobody can see when they're driving by? Like, they're really not playing any games this year. That's crazy to me. They're blocking the whole thing off. You see a little bit of the show. I guess just a little bit, but they're blocking this whole damn thing off. Let me in, let me in, thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate you, Freddie. Good to go, cool, cool. Just try not to hit this trailer. Make it. All right, so we made it out. It's our parking spot. We do have to walk around, but I mean, we're literally right next to the house, which is crazy. So I'm about to catch up with them in a second, but I just gotta get appreciation for how close we are. That's freaking crazy, isn't it? Rick Ross, number two, number two. What we got? We got a gang up here. Yeah. I'll turn up. Oh, it has some Chick fil A to start the day. Sitting down. Man. That skillet was so good. Living a dream. I will tell you that the guy came up and told me he was about to tow my truck into Chick fil A. Oh, yeah? Yeah. But hey, truck made it to the show. We made it to the show. It's Rick Ross car show number two. Out here with the gang, the Miami gang. It'll be a long day though, so y'all need to just grab a snack, sit down, throw the video on your TV. It's gonna be a long day. Let's get this bread.
They must know Alex is in the truck, huh? Yeah, bro. Yeah, I'm in the truck, huh? <laughs> I was just thinking about that. Just stunting on him a little bit. Honestly, it's freaking crazy out here right now. There's loud music everywhere, people everywhere. It's it's a it's been a great time. It's been a great show. It's like two o'clock. I'm moving Liza's truck so we can get it washed. And once we get all the vehicles washed, we're really gonna do some walking around. We really had haven't had much of a chance. I really want to get one of those Rick Ross hats, so we're definitely gonna go do that too. Like I said, we're we're trying to finish getting up all we're trying to finish getting all the trucks washed. And once we can do that, then we can really have some fun today. This is Sammy's first time seeing his truck. How's it looking? Relifted. With the 14 inch poppies kit. Best lift kit in the world, huh? That shit looks good. It looks, it looks look good. That, look at that. By whom? By whom? Poppies. We might, might have to put a little redhead under there. You know, it's only poppies. A little redhead under there for him. It looks good. You got the best truck out here. You know that? All right, stop it. Keep going. Yeah. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> stop it. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't though. Yeah. Go ahead. No step. Go ahead. <laughs> hey, I see your Instagram stories at the gym. Oh, you seen that? Yeah. 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 
Yeah. Oh, I stepped on that on. Yeah. Oh, I stepped on that on. I'm still coming off the top of the... Bye, Anytime I go to shows and stuff, I try and film something. Me and Sammy did tacos last night. Look what we got here. Look at this. Based out of Miami, little little egg roll food truck. We got what? Philly cheese over there. We got what is that with like barbecue? Hibachi. Hibachi. Pulled pork. Seafood. 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 Egg rolls. And I got a pepperoni one over here. So we're going to chop it up on the channel for y'all. A little pepperoni egg roll. Y'all ever had? Oh. That's fire. That's fire. Yeah. Pepperoni egg rolls. Rick Ross Park Show. Get his bread. No, I woke up this morning and I said, ain't no way I'm not going to have the baddest mullet out here today. Nah, you know. Just ruined my whole day, you know that? Hey, I, I wake up every morning and I piss excellent. Okay? <laughs> Green. Green's the move. Red's my favorite color, though. You're red. Right back, though. You think? Red, I mean, you wear black more though, you know? Yeah. I don't know, that's tough. I don't know. The black's clean and so is the green. It's a hard choice. It depends on how much they are. I might buy them both. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Got the, let me see. Got the green. Oh, I love it. And the black. And the black. You know, you know I had to run up on the red. I had to. I'm going to show you. I'm a, it's a truck. Yeah, it matches a truck. I had it to. It kind of matches a truck. I like, I like the green. I like a, for 65, though, I don't know if I could get three or four, though. I ain't built like that. I ain't built like that either. <laughs> I just got mommy and daddy's money. <laughs> like, like the skits. <laughs> 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 Be careful, see if they're in What's, what's your name? Shane. Shane? Yeah, that's my buddy Jeff's truck. Shane said he, he watches the, the video. He out of Augusta, Georgia. Which one? This, this, the this one? Green, the green. That's little, that's little, uh, little Prime. Hell it's yeah. Optimus Prime. If you look at the front, Count Custom drew the, uh, really? the Prime on the front of it. Yeah. Oh, the, that's dope. I'm going to I'm have to go check yeah. that out. Yeah, check that baby out, man. That's dope. Hey, he said he watches the videos. I just want to show oh, some yeah, love. Oh, yeah, I watch his videos all the time. You're cracking me up, man. <laughs> right now, no, sir, there's no vehicles moving here until 7 o'clock. All right. Please go park it right now. Go park it right now. Thank you. All right, bro. Adios, amigo. They'll only kick us out one time, right? Yeah, you feel me? Who? That guy. I think he threw his arm out of the pocket when he said no. No fucking wood. <laughs>
Fuck you, fuck you on the chair. Let's go. Oh, fuck you. Yeah. Who know the word? Thank you. I'm starting out my day with a blood party. Whoa. I've been waiting for my new center caps to come in. And did Cat, did Cat King do these? Who did these? Huh? Who Cat did these? King. Cat right. King. But the thing is, look, you see how they have from when you polish it, Hand all polish. the shit yeah, that yeah. in there. Yeah, the same thing. Because I, I, I had a. Did King you ever like see my old wheels? My old wheels had a uh, bread gang set. I'll have to send you a picture of it. Same exact thing. They hand polish it so it keeps yeah, a little polish in there. These guys fucking clean my but, truck and look at that, bro. I leave my shit looking like a glass. I don't know. Cap, if, I don't even know what the fuck they sprayed on here. Cap King does a really good, really good set of caps up. Shout out to everybody that put that fire whips out. Maybach music. All the fire ladies, if you got some good, roll it up right now. You got a bell edge and take, we'll take a shot right now. And fuck with us, double OG, we back in the building. Let's get it! I see Look, I've, I've seen him like, I see it feels like 10 times today and I want to make sure I always show love to him in the videos. He's always, he always do, never so, miss. Solid ass dude, I always got to throw his face in there, it's nothing but love. I appreciate He's that. He's killing it, if y'all don't know who he is, you're living under a fucking rock, y'all got to subscribe. Yes, He's got the, the baddest squatted truck in the whole game. He's been at Rick Ross' show twice now and... He's up, he's up there. Number one in my book right now. So y'all stop playing. Go show some love. Papa Clutch is out here killing it. That's all I'm saying. I appreciate that, man. Y'all do the same as well. Make sure y'all like this video. Comment on this video. Subscribe. Y'all show mad love to that wild bow tie because it's only going up in here. I appreciate that, bro. Absolutely. Show mad love. I all appreciate love, Going to get back on the bus. Putting in the work, and anytime I see y'all, gotta throw y'all in the video. Shout out to the GQ boys. They always show love to me, so every time I see them, I gotta show love. It's nothing man, but love from us you, over bro, here. So they've, was, been, they've been doing big things. Next time I see y'all, the listen, Ray Raw Show next year. Hey, look, next year, I'm looking to shut it's, it down. It's gonna no be, detail of comedy but one, and that's gonna be GQ. Watch 
what I say, man. Hey, I, for real, I need y'all to come by the shop because I need to start taking care of myself. So. <laughs> listen, I'm going to have to get I'm you on the McDonald's, payroll. You know, I got hey, you, listen, man. We got so you. Gonna, 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 we're going we're gonna to tap that's in. All, we'll make it happen. Man. There's going to be more of them at the shop. Y'all go show some love to GQ. Yes, sir. Frank just offered him 25000 for this. You stuck at 30. At 30, I, really, I really want 35. If you can do 30, Frank, I'll bring it to Miami for this week. Matter of fact, I'll bring it to Miami when I leave this one. What do you want to do? You tell me. I mean, it will look crazy with diesel wheels on it. Yeah, right. That's what he does. He, has, he, okay. he, has a, he makes his own wheels. Oh yeah, this it right here. This it right here. This is what you need. Dirty hydraulic, hydraulic bed and everything. Yeah, hydraulic yeah. bed and everything. What motor's in it? Uh, it's a whole, it's, you can get up here. You want me to bring it back down? Nah, you already got it up there. What else I got, a 460? Nah, it ain't no big block. It's small. What is that, 351? What do you mean, Uh, I think it's the, um, I have to ask the mechanic, because I'm not really prepared with that one. It's not one of those. Hey, I drive shaft down to the hole. I'm a razzle in this thing. What happened to the front drive shaft? Uh, truck came like this. I don't yeah. know all that shit. Yeah, you know. We'll dump some sand with that motherfucker. Nah, I mean, say it again. You said you can dump some sand with that bitch. Uh, nah, nah, nah. landscaping. Yeah. And we can sell it to Ross. Yeah. yeah. And, uh, we was already trying to, trying to get Ross. I was trying yeah. to give you 25 because I got it sold for 40 to him. That's what, we, that's what we want. But I got it sold for 40, but I got to make a, I got to make some money, dog. So, so do Keep this real. You say 25 right now. No, I can't do 25. Impossible. Can't do it. I know what you're talking about. 30 minutes, I'll give I got 10 on me, boss. I got 10 in my mouth. You feel me? So I know, I know. Real. I'm just saying. So that's, that's nothing. I know. You know, I'm, I know. I'm just, but I'm saying, I bring this trip to Miami. I'm coming to Miami anyway this weekend. Yeah, yeah. This is why I'm the luckiest person in history because not only did I get into the show for free, I'm gonna tell you this just because you're standing here, so I'm not talking to us. Not only did I get into the show at little to no cost, not only did I get lucky and get to park my truck in the show and not have to Uber or anything, but now we're walking around the side of Rick Ross's house to go into the VIP mixer. Again, because I have the greatest friends in the entire freaking world. And Manny's up there laughing at me. So. So you're so in front of exactly Rick Ross's right. house and God, God and Green Earth. So it ain't Let's get his bread, baby. <laughs> That's that truck that won first prize over there. <laughs> the one with the red wheels? It's a good looking truck, isn't it? Right, gang. Yeah. Freddie call you again? Look at those center caps. That was Freddie that called you? Yeah. yeah.
I was taking my shoes off to jump in as he walked up. Oh, yeah. And he didn't realize I had my shoes off. Yeah. Oh, this is dope. Oh, yeah, this is dope. Good little, little pepperoni action in there. Uh, damn. Look, they got pepperoni cheese, meat lover, or uh, veggie. What's going on over here? Little, little salad action. All right, all right. What's down here? You want some, some sparkles? Your girls didn't cheap out on the Starbucks, that's for sure. A little salad. A little apple action. Florida boy. A little gym down there or something. Just want to let y'all know that I'm in Rick Ross's garage right now. There's a Ferrari sign, Bentley sign, Rolls Royce. Just so they can get a better Florida boy. Yeah. This is the, the main reason I wanted to make this clip is I'm in Rick Ross's garage right now, eating pizza and ranch. Do all I do is your food behind the scenes? Is that like my new thing? For now, yeah. Hey, we've had some. Dude. I had egg rolls today. We had Chick-fil-A this morning. And we're eating Where's pizza you? now. You want to make it? For sure. No, they didn't just put chicken wings up here. Oh, denied, bro. That sucks. Manny gave me one of his chicken wings. I don't know what flavor it is, but we secured the bag and I got one. Remember, you always gotta piss excellence. It's kinda of spicy, actually. I might have to wash my mouth down by jumping in the pool. You won't. Face first. You won't. No. You won't jump. I don't wanna get kicked out. You're not gonna get one second. You know what the coolest thing about this whole right now is? Free watermelon? The fact that, yes, all the great food, but look at the top of the hill. Oh, such a letdown. Moff Keith Cobb doesn't. Uh, hey! <laughs> you boy up there! Yeah. My camera's about to die. So I want to show y'all a couple of cool things I got at the show. First one, we got a signed Rick Ross hat, which is the coolest thing in the whole freaking world. A couple of us got these, which is really just the coolest thing I've ever seen. I got this Rick Ross car show hat with all the sponsors on the inside, which is super cool. With a little pin to go on it. And then we made it into the VIP mixer tonight and they gave us this bag, a little Rick Ross car show duffel bag with some stuff in a little car towel, some like, what are these, like Herbalife packages, something. We'll have to look into these meal replacement little bars or something, some, you know, little protein stuff. But the coolest thing is, I'm not a drinker, but Rip Ross Car Show, Bel Air. Freaking cool. Little VIP bag. Great way to end the day off. 6x6 Ram, 6x6 Chevy. Sutton's beautiful 450. They did not let him get into the show even though he paid for VIP, which kind of sucks. And then we got the new Poppy's tow rig over here as well. Look at that freaking thing out there. That must be Laz. Yeah, that's Laz's truck way out there. That's cool. Hell of a day. Rick Ross Car Show 2023. And by the way, happy birthday. Let's get his breath. show was yesterday we came out here for day number two nothing show going on today we're just kind of loading everything up Manny's loading up his uh, all of his stuff to go to New Jersey that we're doing next week 
and then we just kind of came up here to hang out for a little bit while they were loading up and then we might get something to eat but it's just kind of cool to be up here at his house when nobody else is here there might be you know one or two little stragglers left here and there loading stuff up but it's just cool to be able to come and you know be at rick ross's house during the day when you're not really supposed to be here you know what i mean so we're just up here hanging out for a little bit This is one of my favorites from yesterday. Really nice Camaro that Frank's taking home with him. I don't even know what year it is, to be honest. I'm not a car guy, but I wanted to show y'all something cool. The whole interior has been custom done. It's got the new body style dash, new body style steering wheel. Whole interior has been redone. The body panels, or sorry, the interior door panels were all 3D printed. And then he was kind of showing me a bunch of like really nice custom body work that was done. The seamless glass in the back. You got newer style lights and stuff on the back. Just absolutely beautiful car. He was saying that the car is pretty much priceless. A bunch of custom uh, work done on the hood up here. The engine bay is completely spotless, completely brand new. He said if somebody tried to offer him some money, it'd take half a million dollars because there's just so much time and work and money put into this that it's kind of priceless. But this is one of my favorite cars from yesterday and we just happened to get to see it today. Laz is loading up over there. Shout out to Laz and Lewis, Legend Motorsports. Marley's all loaded up waiting. We got the white six by six and the black six by six over here all loaded up i think rose is hanging out on the opposite side of the courtyard over there which is cool so like i said they're taking the ram the six by six and then there's a 450 that we came in with yesterday with sammy's new fifth gen kit i know that andrew's about to get one of those they're taking those tonight to new jersey and their flight leaves tomorrow at like eight or nine o'clock so they're flying back to miami and then we're all flying in to new jersey on thursday night so they have a uh, quite the drive ahead of them, to say the least.